Retro Racing Reports from Kearney Bowl, Fresno, California. This is Sunday, April 23, 1961. USAC. J.C. Agajania presents 50-lap National Championship Midget Auto Race. You might notice that J.C. Agajanian calls a lot of his promotions national championships. Be sure to like, subscribe, and leave your comments down below. We'd sure appreciate it. Hey, Johnny Morehouse is a veteran of 15 years of midget auto race competition, driving his first race at Oceanside in 1946 and going on to win the URA Midget Championship in 1953. John is 39 years old and calls Santa Ana his home. He operates a successful service station business when not racing full-time. He's been at Indianapolis the last two years, but has yet to pass his driving test. He spun the Binter Special in 1959, and last year the Thompson Industry Special was not able to gain enough speed for the run. Johnny will be driving the number 46 Red and Cream Offie owned by Guy Van Breckel of Downey. He's the same mount that Billy Vukovic and Johnny Parsons drove with great success. Morehouse ran third with it last month at San Bernardino. In one of the closest contests in midget racing history, Jimmy Davies, a veteran driver from Gardena, won the 1960 National 110 Offenhauser Championship for USAC. He defeated Bob Wendt of St. Louis by a matter of only 9.75 points and will be driving the number one Davies off in today's race. Davies has been racing since 1945 and during that time won three national championship victories. He was the winner at Springfield in 54 and in Phoenix and Del Mar in 1950. He's driven in five Indianapolis 500 mile races and in 1951 held the lead for a short time. He finished third in his last appearance in the Classic in 1955. In 1960, he finished in the top six in 34 of the 55 races in which he started. He really won the championship with his remarkable qualifying record. He was the fastest qualifier at 19 races, or over one-third of the total events. Dempsey Wilson is a veteran of the Pacific Coast Midget Trail, beginning his career in 1946 at Prescott, Arizona. A Lawndale, California veteran will be driving Eddie Meyer Engineering Special in today's race with number 99 Junior adorning the side of the car. Dempsey has participated in two Indianapolis 500-mile races. Both times he was forced into the pits with engine trouble. In 1958, he had completed 151 laps when a broken clutch forced him to the sidelines. Last year, it was a magneto failure on the 11th lap that cost him further participation in the annual Classic. While Dempsey devoted little time to the Midgets last season, he was active on the National Championship Trail, finishing in the 31st position in the National Championships with the big cars. Always a tough competitor, Wilson will be among the favorites to cop today's action on the fast Kearney Bowl Oval. Car owner is Eddie Meyer of Hollywood, California. Veteran of many years driving experience, Bullet Joe Garson will return to active competition today as the oldest driver on the USAC circuit. Joe recently celebrated his 47th birthday and is still going strong with the youngsters competing in today's race. Garson will sit in their number 35 Walker Offy, owned by A.J. Walker of Los Angeles in today's 50-lap feature. During the 1960 season, Joe competed in but three races in the midget category to finish in the number 66 position. He earned 36 points for his efforts during these three races and hopes to surpass that number in a single day here at Kearney Bowl this afternoon. Long a favorite of the midget fraternity, Joe is always among the first to reach the track and get his 110 off in tune for the day's activities. Johnny Tolan of Downey, California, will tool the Lloyd Ridge Offy in today's feature 50-lap midget race at Kearney Bowl. Tolan finished 8th in Pacific Coast midget standings last year and was the number 30 spot in national standings at season's end. The Downey Flash will be driving number 98, owned by Lloyd Ridge of Oakland in today's race. 
In six races last year, his best finish was fourth. But he's looking for a better spot in the race today when the checkered flag is flashed at the conclusion of this 50-lap feature. Johnny has tried just about every type of racing vehicle on the circuit and hopes to find a ride in the big one at Indianapolis on Memorial Day. But right now, it's first things first, and he's concentrating on today's midget race feature. Hey, this is Harold. Glad you enjoyed that video. Be sure to like, subscribe, share, put your comments down below. There's a lot more where this one came from.